This is the scheme of work for SS2 first term chemistry for week one. For week one, we're going to be learning about our canals, which is under organic chemistry. So we'll be learning about the types and properties of our canals, preparation of our canals, industrial production of our canals, fermentation, esterification, and uses of our canals. This is under organic chemistry. And your teacher will make sure you understand all these key points. Okay, let's move to the next one. For week two, we'll be learning about the periodic table. Okay, the periodic table. We learn about the periodic law, the blocks of elements that you have. Talking about P block, S block, D block, and so on like that. The properties of the SPDF um, groups of elements. Talking about alkali metals, alkaline earth metals, and other family of metals or elements. Then these are the key points that you must also understand. Okay, the next one for for week three. We learn about the periodic table too because the periodic table is very very wide. So we learn learning it again in week three. So for week three, we learn properties and the changes in the sizes and changes down the group. Boiling point, how does it vary down the group or across the period? Talking about ionization energy, atomic size and ionic sizes, how do they vary across the period or down the group? So that's what we'll be learning in, period, in, in week three. Also, we'll be talking about the diagonal relationship between elements, ionization energy and electron affinity. Okay, we'll be learning about that in week three. Then, for week four, we're talking about chemical reactions. The basis of chemical reaction, talking about the basic concept like reactants, products, reaction time, and reaction rates. You also will learn about collision theory. The teacher will make sure you have all these um, particular guidelines. Okay, talking about common reagents like HCl, CSO4, NaCl, and NH4OH, which is ammonium hydroxide. So, for week five, you also learn about chemical reactions again. Okay, talk about the factors affecting or influencing chemical reactions, talking about the nature of the substance, concentration, the pressure, temperature, addition of catalyst, and so on. You also learn about the types of chemical reactions, talking about endothermic reaction and exothermic reaction. Then you also learn about this formula, a very important formula, which will help you to determine the free energy of a system. So this topic is very, very, very important and jump all the set questions on this topic. So you need to pay attention to what your teacher is going to teach you. Then for week six, you learn about chemical reactions again. Talking about chemical equilibrium, we are learning about the Le Chandler's principle, the factors affecting the equilibrium, talking about temperature change, concentration, pressure, and so on like that. This is for week six. Then for week seven, some schools will be doing tests by this time. But if you're not doing tests, your teacher can also teach you mass volume relationship. This is about stoichiometry. So we're learning about relative density, molar mass, standard temperature and pressure, that's STP. We also learn about mole, molar quantities and molarity. Okay, so that's for week seven. Then for week eight, we learn about mass volume relationship. This is also under stoichiometry. It's basically about calculation. This week seven and week eight is about calculation. Okay, so keep that in mind. Then for week nine, we learn about acid-base reactions. Okay, acid acid base and salt, talking about pH value, common indicators, um, simple acid-base reactions, and titration rather. So we learn about these things. You also be doing the practical in your school. The teacher will teach you how to do titration practical. Then for the week 10, we be doing about acid-base reactions again. Then week 11, the same thing because this topic is very, very wide. You talk about heat of neutralization, construction of wooden retort stand, and so on like that. Then for your week 12 to week 13, we do your, we do your revision and your exams. So I hope you have gained one or two things from watching this video. If you have any challenge, let me know in the comment section and let me know if there's any topic that you want me to treat concerning these topics that I just gave to you guys. If you are new to this channel, if you are new to this channel, make sure you click the subscribe button, okay? And check out the next video on your screen right now, which is going to help you in your academic study. Thank you for watching. You've been blessed. Peace.